Welcome back friends. I'm Sir Puffington, and today we are going to learn how to estimate and measure elapsed time using number lines. Here you go Sir Puffington. Thanks Crush. We're going to be baking today, an activity where we often need to add and subtract time. Using a clock can be helpful, but sometimes it is easier to use a number line. I whipped up this cake batter earlier today, we just need to put it in the oven. Let's put it in the oven at 4.30 pm. After 30 minutes we can take the cake out. What time can we take the cake out? Let's look at the number line. Each tick mark on the number line represents a 30 minute interval. We will start at 4.30 pm and make one 30 minute jump. We land at 5 pm and that is when we can take the cake out to decorate. Ok time for the cupcakes. I did not make the batter in advance. Let me read the recipe. If we start cooking at 5 o'clock, we should be done at around 6.25. That's my best estimate based on these directions. Let's use the model to determine how long that'll take us. If we start at 5 o'clock and make 1, 2, 3 jumps and land at 6.30, because it's the closest interval on the number line to 6.25, it will take us about 1 and a half hours or 1 hour and 30 minutes to make the cupcakes. I guess there's no time to waste. Let's get started. Thanks for taking the time to bake with us. Have a sweet day, 